Hey everyone, in this video, I'll show you how to easily get an active developer badge in Discord. And if you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing and leaving a like. So first things first, make sure your Discord is open here and then just go on to discord.com developer portal. And click the first link here, Discord developer portal. Okay, so now that we're here, just click on the top left that says Applications. And then on the top right here, just click on New Application. And you can choose any name you want. Just, I'm just going to put Test here. And then click on Create. And once you've done that, just go over here to the left and click on the Bot Puzzle icon. And then just click on reset token yes do it and then just click on copy now once you've got that copy just go to another website called bot ghost and just click on create a bot click on authorize And here just paste the bot token that we copied earlier and then click on create bot. And yeah, we'll just click on next here. All right. And now what we want to do is active developer badge. Just go over here on the left and scroll down and you'll see this one here under server management. Or you can just click it here. Just click that. Making sure that it's enabled there. So once you've done that, just go back on here. And so just make sure that you already have your own server. So I already have one here, which is my testing server. So just click on the drop down here and then click on server settings. And down here, there's something called enable community. Click that and then click get started. S skip through these. Yeah, just create one for me then finish setup all right so now your server is a community server and once you've done that go back to your discord developer portal over here click on this setting icon url generator and then just make sure that you check bot and then applications commands here so once that's good, just click here on Administrator for the general permissions. Then just click here on Copy. Copy that. And once you've copied that, just go on a new tab and then Control Paste. Then just click on Continue. Authorize. And then just do the CAPTCHA. All right. Test has been authorized and added to how to library server. As you can see, bot ghost is already here. Now all you have to do is just type slash active developer badge, click enter. All right, so it gives you a link on where to claim it. And, and as you can see here, you may have to wait up to 24 hours for Discord to update its systems. So maybe you'll have to wait one or maybe even two days in order to get your active developer badge. So as you can see here, you're still not eligible. So just wait a few days and it should say that you're eligible. So it's the next day. And as you can see, when I go back to the active developer site, now I can claim my badge. So let's just select the options that I have here. And then subscribe to our announcements, maybe just moderator only. And here, as you can see, it'll ask you to select the active application that we made earlier with bot ghost. And then here, the server where the bot is. And then just a channel with the server since Discord actually sends um, announcements to the developers. So click on the green claim button. And as you can see, you have finally claimed your active developer badge. So let's try and visit our profile here. Just go back to discord.com. And as you can see, I now have the active developer badge on my profile. 
Alright, so if you found this video useful, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to watch all the upcoming videos, and goodbye.